I am Dr. Durga Prasad, HOD Cardiac Surgery Department, Vaidehi Hospital. Causes for chest pain are plenty actually. Uh, most important is our myocardial infarction, that is angina. You know, when there is no blood supply to the heart, then you get a severe chest pain, which radiates to the arm, sweating will be there, vasovagal effects. It will also radiate to the jaw. So many issues. That is the most important dreaded uh, cause for patients to die, angina. Because what do you call it as myocardial infarction, or you call it as a, no blood supply to the heart. Even the heart should require a blood supply that is impeded, then you get a severe chest pain. Other causes of chest pain are like, you know, as you said, uh, severe coughing, like bronchitis, costochondritis, even the dissection of iota. Suppose iota is split into two. There are three layers in major vessels. If suppose it is split into two or three, then you get a severe chest pain. Then you have a cardiac pericarditis where uh, infection or inflammation of the pericardium covering over the heart can produce chest pain. Then the pleura, the covering in of the lung, which is inflamed, also can get a chest pain. Then there is inflammation of the bones like ribs and sternum, you can get chest pain. The causes for chest pains are plenty, but most important thing one should worry is when you get angina, that is blood supply to the heart getting impeded. That's the most important thing. One should be aware to see whether it's angina or anything, one should be able to seek medical help as soon as possible once he gets that kind of chest pain. So what I say is any chest pain should not be neglected. You have to go to a near good hospital or a cardiac center and get it, get yourself evaluated.